What's up, YouTube? It's your boy Emperor Vaza back with another NBA 2K17 video. I hope you guys enjoyed that little intro in the beginning of today's video. In today's video, we're gonna be covering some nasty combo drill moves that you can actually spam after patch 11. Nasty combo drill moves in today's video. So if you're new to the YouTube channel, be sure to hit that subscribe button for some future NBA 2K17 content. It helps the channel grow, and I appreciate it if we can get 1,000 likes on this YouTube video for your boy. But nonetheless, let's jump into the first move. And the first move that you're going to need for today's tutorial is going to be this Kyle Lowry crossover size up combo. Now, as you guys can see right here in this little preview, it, it is pretty fast. It's a fast animation. A lot like the Carmelo crossover size up combo, but make sure you have that Kyle Lowry equipped. And the second move that you're going to need with, with this move is going to be this Elite 3 basic size up. Make sure you have both of those moves equipped to your My Player. And now let's go to our My Courts after you have equipped both of those moves. And the reason that you want to have both of those moves equipped to your my players is because for some reason the basic size of Elite 3 move actually makes the Kyle Larvy crossover even more faster. As you guys can tell right here on my mic core, I'm just spamming it left to right with the right analog stick. You literally, if you have the ball in your right hand, all you want to do is flick it to the left and then flick it to the right. If you have it on your left hand, all you want to do is flick your right analog stick to the right and then to the left. It's very easy to do this. I'm just showing you guys the basic steps and then we're going to add some combos with this move. But as you guys can tell, I am spamming it right here. It's going to be nasty at the park if you use this. Just a fast ass crossover. But enough of all this double crossover shit. Now let's start mixing in some combos with it. Now for combo number one, you are going to see me doing like three or five crossovers at once. I'm literally doing this Kyle Lowry double crossover that we just went over. I'm going to add a basic size up and then I'm going to do a hop jumper. So you're literally doing like five crossovers. It's going to be nasty at the park. So if you have the ball in your right hand, all you simply want to do is flick your right analog stick without holding down turbo, left to right. And as soon as you have done that, then you hold down that right trigger and then hit your right analog stick to the left to activate that basic size up, holding down that right trigger. Remember that. And release that right trigger and hit the hop jumper to your right side. Very easy. So again, one more time, if the ball is in your right hand, flick your right analog stick left to right. As soon as you have done that, hold down that right trigger, flick your right analog stick to the left side. And as soon as you have done that, press X and then flick your left analog stick to the right. Do that final hop jumper. It's going to be nasty because you're throwing so many crossovers at once and then you can just speed boost out of it whenever the hell you would feel like it. Very nasty combo drum move right there. Now let's move on to another batch of moves. Now for the first move that you're going to need for this uh, combo drum move is going to be basic size up normal 4. Make sure you have that equipped. It's very essential for this next move that we're going to be going over. And after you have equipped that, then another move that you're going to need is going to be this between the leg size up Lance Stevenson. Now just like in the previous move that we just went over, you need both of these moves to make another move faster. For some reason when you have a, uh, a certain basic size up, it makes that other move really fast. Now as you guys can see right here on my mic court, this is the Lance Stevenson and normal 4 basic size up move that I am talking to you about. It is a spamming move just like the Kyle, just like that Kyle Lowry that we just went over. But I actually really like this move right here. But I like it more than the Kyle Lowry in my opinion. Like I said, you need that basic side up to make it as fast as I'm doing it right here on my mic court. But in order to do this move, it's very easy. If you have the ball in your right hand, all you simply want to do is flick your right analog stick diagonally down to the left side. So diagonally down to the left and then you're going to want to flick your right stick diagonally up to the right side. To put it into simple terms, all you really want to do is just keep putting the ball in between your legs. Like literally diagonally down, diagonally up, diagonally down, diagonally up. That's literally all you're doing and that's how you're going to be able to spam this Lance Stevenson crossover move. Now this move alone will get you ankle breakers but it is not going to get you self, it's not going to get you open. So I recommend that you mix it in with some rhythm dribble but that's exactly what we're going to go over next. We're going to go over some combo moves. So now let's go over combo number one. Now for combo move number one, as you guys can see right here on my mic core, I am putting the ball in between my legs really fast and I am doing a behind the back animation out of it. I really like to do the step back animation when I'm doing this in my tutorial just so you guys can see the move clearly. It's a very nice clean animation when you mix in these together, these Lance Stevenson and these behind the back moves. So in order to do this move, all you really want to do is have the ball in your right hand, flick your right analog stick diagonally down to the left side, and then flick your right analog stick diagonally up to the right side. To activate that Lance Stevenson, as soon as you have done that animation, just simply flick your right analog stick down and then flick your left analog stick to the left side to run to the left side of the court to do that behind the back move. A really fast combo move, you're literally just putting the ball between your legs, a double crossover, and then you're doing a behind the back move. And after that, you can really mix it in with whatever the hell you want. You can do a momentum crossover, a momentum behind the back. Really, the possibilities are endless. Once you do this combo move, you can even add a spin move. Just get yourself open. Very easy. I'm just giving you guys the basic foundations of a combo drill move to mix in whatever you guys would like to do after this move. 
Now for combo move number two, this one's gonna be a little bit tricky, but I actually really like this move. As you guys can tell, I'm doing the Lance Stevenson twice. I am literally putting the ball in between my legs twice. I'm doing the Lance Stevenson twice, and then I'm gonna hit the normal five rhythm dribble. You can hit it with what other rhythm dribble that you would like, whatever your favorite one is, but I like normal five. In order to do this move, all you really want to do is literally hit the Lance Stevenson twice and then hit a rhythm dribble. So if you have the ball in your right hand, diagonally down to the left and then diagonally up to the right, diagonally down to the left, diagonally down, diagonally up to the right. You hit that Lance Stevenson twice and then just literally flick your right hand stick up to activate that rhythm dribble and just take off for that speed boost. Nasty combo move right there. But yeah guys, that is today's video. Thank you for checking out the video. If you're new to the YouTube channel, be sure to hit that subscribe button. It really helps the channel grow and I appreciate your support so damn much. I'm just always trying to help you guys out any way I possibly can. Always trying to help out the community any way I possibly can, like I said. Please hit that subscribe button. It has been your boy Emperor Mufasa. Let's get 1,000 likes on this YouTube video for your boy. But nonetheless, I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.